Hi guys, what is up? Welcome to the life of Chai. My name is Chai and on this vlog, I share some clips from our snow adventures the Ski Mart Talk one weekend in February 2022. So Ski Mart Talk is about an hour's drive from downtown Halifax. We got on NS 101, took exit 5 to trunk 14, and headed up Ski Mart Talk Road to get to our destination. So in this channel, I do share some notes and tips about immigrating to Canada and moving to Halifax, Nova Scotia, mostly from a DIY perspective, but I also have vlogs like this about living in Halifax, Nova Scotia and having fun. So those trails right there on the side of the mountain are the trail of Ski Martok. So for this trip, we arrived around 8 o'clock. That structure with a green roof right there is where we ride the key bar. The incline is the starter hill, and then the main building where the gear rental space is, as well as the ticket booth and the dining area. So on this trip, Jade and our friends signed up for ski lessons. They got the discovery package for $75, tax included, so that had the lessons gear rental and lift passes. But for myself, I decided to go snowboarding, a bit of an experiment for me. For myself, no lessons, I just paid for the gear rental and lift tickets, but that still ended up almost the same cost as the discovery lessons. So this is the gear rental space um, where you get your helmets, your boots, for Jade and our gang, the skis, and for myself, my boots and the snowboard. I started on the bunny hill, fell over and back a couple of times. Um, this is me on my second run on the bunny hill. I had to shimmy 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 to get on the slope. Yeah, of course I cover the camera when I gain momentum, whatever. I just, just try to get a feel of the board again. Um, yeah, so props to Jade who tried out skiing in spite of a very bad back. I'm super proud of her and her friends who graduated from the Starter Hill. And they tried out the bunny hill and they even some of them even took the t-bar mid height of the mountain um so yeah i guess like a lot of achievements were unlocked on this day So after my run on the bunny hill, I tried the T-bar where I was painfully unsuccessful, kept falling over it like twice. Um, just couldn't figure it out. Um, I ended up taking the chairlift all the way to the very top. Um, come to think of it, I never did learn to ride the T-bar. I did snowboarding four years back when I was living in Japan. 
but even then it was already a chairlift from the get-go. So this is the trail map for Skimar Top. Um, I only checked it out when I was already at the top and just trying to figure out how to go down and get home. So you can see here the trails with difficulty levels. Obviously the beginner levels are at the, the bunny hill and the starter hill. Um, but then when I got to the top, I just basically followed the families with kids and even the kids group lessons because I figured that may be the safest route for me for my skill level. So this is me. I did stop every so often. My legs were getting tired more than anything until I finally reached the base. Um, and then yay, I got home, fell asleep, slept from 5 p.m. till 9 a.m. the next day. Um, so that was our s snow adventure trip. Um, beginner to beginner, I would say my best tip is not to be afraid to fall. From Jay's and our friend's instructor, remember that snow is soft, people are soft, trees are not. So we'd rather fall into the snow than crash into a tree, basically. First stop is Naro Espresso, favorite. Um, yeah, so the next day, next day um, obviously getting over um, the physical tolls of like playing in the snow, like what we did. Um, we just had a show day, had brunch, went to Lawson's, ate at Bliss Caffeine Bar, and um, so that was one weekend in and around Halifax, Nova Scotia. Um, yeah, <laughs> so it's pretty quiet. It's, it's just Sunday. I don't know people are probably staying in, sleeping in, probably out of town, out of the slopes like we did go um, snowboarding um, at Mark Dock yesterday. I went snowboarding. Um, Jade and her friends um, went skiing. I'm not. I'm not confident about my ability to, to ski, so that's that's the main reason why. I can only imagine myself doing the split <laughs> if I had my, my two feet on two separate planks I would rather have them on the seat board and fall together than split um that's probably why and um yeah this is south in Halifax this is one of the bus stops uh, buses 4, 10, and 14. Um, I think bus 4 goes up to Lacewood. 10 is uh, Dalhousie. It goes around nearby Dalhousie University. 14? I have no idea. I probably forgot. I might not have taken it before. Okay, so brunch is done. Next stop, Sobeys. 
How was your drink? <laughs> How was your drink? What did you get? What did you get as best? Mm -hmm. You end up drinking. Yeah, I did. She didn't know. She didn't know it was. Um, it was supposed to be. Oh, squirrel. Okay, it's not. You're not going to see it. Uh, <laughs> Yeah, she wanted something to rehydrate, but she ended up still getting coffee, so that's not... <laughs> I don't think that's the best, like the most rehydrated drink. But, um, yeah, so she didn't know it had... The, the, the lemonade has had gin in it, so I ended up um, finishing that off. On top of my Bailey's coffee that I didn't even finish at all. Um, yeah, and we did get a... We did get the fried chicken as always, half as always. And then a strawberry cone and um, strawberry cone and cinnamon. So we are back at the crossing. South Park, Morris Street. Um, and we are headed towards Sobe. Get a couple of stuff, um, milk. What else? What else are we getting at Sobe? What? Butter. butter. Yeah, because we used to have all our butter from all the mac and cheese that we've been making. <laughs> yeah. Okay, we're crossing the street now. No, 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 no. Apparently not yet. Okay, there you go. Um, the rest of the south end. Okay, and here we are back again, back home. I'm just doing the laundry. Yeah, just part of the laundry duties. We got an empty um, empty machine right here. If you're planning a move to this beautiful city, I hope you check out the other videos I hope I have on this channel, The Life of Chai. Please feel free to hit the like button. Um, if you know someone planning to move to Canada, please feel free to share. If you like seeing more, con more of these content getting updated, please hit the subscribe button. Thank you so much and I'll see you in the next video.